In this video I will show you how to use the K-more nail knot tool. The first knot I will show you is used to join fly line back in to fly line. Run the back in line through the forked slot and trap the back in against the thumb pad. Hold the line taut and make four or five turns along the fork taking care not to overlap. The index finger can be used as required to prevent line slipping. Thread the end of the backing line through the coils. Take the end of the fly line and thread about one inch through the coils in the opposite direction. Take hold of the free end of the backing and give a sharp tug to pull the knot from the tool and onto the fly line. Trim the ends. Next, I will show you how to use the knot tool to tie on a fly, hook or spinner. Thread the end of the line through the eye of the hook and pull out 6 to 8 inches of line to work with. Hook the fly over the bridge at the rear of the knot tool. Run the line over the thumb pad through the forked slot and trap both strands of line against the thumb pad. Hold the tag end taut and make four or five turns along the fork, taking care not to overlap. The index finger can be used as required to prevent the line slipping. Thread the end of the line back through the coils. Take hold of the tag end of line and give a sharp tug to pull the knot from the tool. With the hook still safely held in the tool, Steadily pull the main line to draw the knot towards the eye of the hook. Pull tight to seat the knot. Trim the tag end. Now I will show you how to splice lines together. Hold the line in the tool and pull out 6 to 8 inches. Hold the line taut and make 4 or 5 turns. Take care not to overlap and use the index finger to prevent the line slipping. Thread the end of the line back through the coils. Take the second line and thread 6 to 8 inches in the opposite direction. Give a sharp tug on the first line to pull the knot from the tool and onto the second line. Turn the pair of lines end for end and place them back in the knot tool. Hold the tag end of the second line taut and make four or five turns. Again, take care not to overlap and use the index finger to prevent the line slipping. Thread the tag back through the coils and give a sharp tug to pull the knot from the tool and onto the first line. Release the lines and pull steadily to tighten and draw the knots together. Trim the tag ends.